Hello everyone and welcome to today's episode. Today we're going to show you how to use Excel spreadsheet data, how to convert that into pipe delimited data so that you can use that in vMix UTC to populate graphics. VMix UTC does not support comma separated values. That's why we're going to show you how you can convert your data to pipe delimited data for use in vMix. This and so much more on today's episode of One Man Stream. The first thing we're going to do is set up our computer to accept pipe delimited data. We need to go to our uh, control panel and then we're going to go to date, time, and regional settings and then advanced time and region settings and then click on the region button there and then go to additional settings and you'll see under list separator it'll be uh, defaulted to comma we'll want to change that to bar sometimes referred to as pipe and then we'll apply the changes and click OK and exit out of that and now we can go to our Excel spreadsheet that we made uh, in our demo and we're going to save that as a comma separated value. You'll see right there where it says CSV, but we've changed it from comma separated to pipe delimited. So when we save it, we'll actually be saving it in a pipe delimited format. So let's go ahead and choose a spot for it, save it. And now we're going to open it up in Notepad. And when we open it up, it should be bar delimited data, which it is. So since we've proven that we've done the conversion correctly, now we can go to the button that we created in VMix UTC and load the list that uh, we just created from our Excel spreadsheet data. And let's go to the load list button. We'll click on that. And we'll go to where we saved our uh, pipe delimited data. That's in documents. Scroll on down. There it is. Click OK. And there's the information. You can see that it's populated correctly into our vMix UTC uh, list button correctly. So now we'll go back up to our button, click the drop down menu, toggle through one piece of data, and you can see that our lower third has changed. Toggle again, it changes once more. And hopefully you can see how easy it is to save your Excel spreadsheet data as pipe delimited data. That's our show for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give us a like if you like what you see here. And make sure you subscribe so that you'll be alerted when new videos are posted.